This camper here is a 2013 Forest River Wildwood. It's 35 feet with three slide outs. This camper is loaded with all kinds of features. I'm going to walk around the outside and as we're walking around the camper, I'll show you some of these features. It has a power leveling jack on the front. It has four electric stabilizer jacks on it and a power awning. It also has a uh, rear backup camera. This camper has everything. One of the uh, incredible features about this camper, it's equipped with what they call the showstopper package. And what that is, is it comes with this little remote control. I'm going to do my best uh, to show you what that is in here. You hit the button and if you want the slide out, you hit that button and you push it and the slide comes out. You could do the same thing with the awning. Uh, you hit the home button and if you want the awning open, you hit that button and you can see the awning starts to come out. You could do that with all the slides as well as the, well, wait a minute. I'm trying to get back to the home screen. Your stabilizer jacks, you can do the same thing with them. If you want to raise them, the stabilizer jack back there is going. You can uh, turn on and off your light. If you want the outside light on, you just hit that button right there and the light goes on and off. So you pretty much only need to unhook this trailer from your truck and just sit there in your camping chair with your little remote control and level and open all your slides. And again, it also has a backup camera that hooks into the cigarette lighter of your vehicle. Uh, the front of the trailer is already wired for it. You just plug it in, and when you're backing into your campsite, you can see everything behind you. I'm going to open this up and take you on the inside. All right, as you can see, we got all the slides open now. I didn't want the video to be too long, uh, but I opened up everything, put down all the leveling jacks with the remote. You could also do it from inside uh, the camper. This is where your, uh, your camera hooks up. Uh, it comes with the wiring harness. It's all set, ready to go. Of course, this raises and lowers the front of the camper. Uh, you do have manual controls, if you want to call them manual. This will lower and raise the stabilizer jack. Uh, so, and it does have slide buttons on the inside. You don't have to rely on that remote. But this remote is also rechargeable. Uh, you just plug it into a USB and it charges up. I'm going to go ahead and take you inside. Uh, again, it's a 2013 uh, Forest River Wildwood 31 QBTS. And honestly, the camper's like brand new. Uh, when we walk in, directly to my right is the front queen bedroom. Uh, with some overhead cabinets and uh, it smells new in here. It has uh, sliding doors that for privacy. It's in perfect condition. I mean there, this camper was only used two times. This is your camera that goes in your vehicle or I mean the monitor I'm sorry and there's the wiring harnesses to go with uh, with the camper. Uh, AM FM stereo CD player this is your entertainment stand. Now, there is a TV on the other side. That swivels around. I'm going to unsnap this on this side and get these doors closed off. As you can see, there's one there. And then there's another door on this side. And there's your TV right there. Now, you could spin that around and you can see what that does and you can watch it from the other side there we go 
So the TV is included, it's installed, AM FM stereo CD player, lots of floor space, uh, sofa bed, big U-shaped dinette, uh, center kitchen, nice gooseneck faucet with a deep well sink. You got a double basin sink there, that's very nice. Beautiful countertops in here, I mean they did a really nice job with the stainless steel appliances. This camper has every option that was available. Uh, this gentleman that bought this camper new spent uh, close to $35,000 for it, so he spent a, a heck of a lot of money. And you can see there's your uh, thermostat, right here is your bathroom, uh, commode, vanity, uh, tower, you know, nice shower and tub combination. Nice high ceilings in here, ceiling height's about 7 foot. So you got lots of room there. Some nice cabinets. Uh, this dinette folds down into a queen size bed. And of course that pulls out to a double bed. This camper is capable of sleeping 12 people. I don't know if you want to take that many people camping, but uh, it sure does sleep a, a heck of a lot. When you walk back here, it's enormous. You can see you got bunks there. Nice high ceilings with the rear entertainment. There's another television mounted there, and more bunks on this side. This floor space is, is incredibly large. Now, I've seen another camper, uh, and here's your slide controls on the inside. I've seen another camper that was like this, and the guy bought this bunkhouse style because he wanted this back room. And what he did was remove these bunks, which come out very easily, and he put recliners on one side, and remove the bunks on the other side. He put a, a, a sofa in that slide with a nice big easy chair and he had himself one big beautiful living room uh, for his bumper pull camper. Because uh, they don't, they do make some bumper pulls with the living room set up, but the living room is much larger if you do it that way. If you remove the bunks and put some furniture back here, you'd have one big room. It would make a heck of an office and it definitely makes one heck of a bedroom. I mean, it's eight feet from the one bed to the other bed is eight feet across. And uh, like I said, you got a television back here, plenty of uh, room for the kids to throw down some beanbag chairs and play video games, whatever they want to do. And they have a, a wooden door that slides across for privacy and keeps them out of your way. Anyway, this is a 2013 Forest River Wildwood it's in like brand new condition that uh, I'd be more than happy to show you. My name is George. My phone number will be in the ad. If you'd like to come take a look at this camper, uh, just give me a call. Thank you for watching my video. I hope it wasn't too long for you. I'm trying to get everything in so you can get a good look at what we're selling here. Thanks again and have a great day.